So today we, we have here a rather unique presentation of the 2000 Millennium Flag 50 cent coin. We have to the left the incused version of the coin and to the right we have the circulated non-incused version of the coin. Uh, what does that mean? Because looking at these side by side they look pretty much the same. Hard to tell the difference. But let me show you what, what I mean by incused. So to the left, see this coin, the incused version. If we look at the cross, the southern cross, um, the lines going diagonal are actually sitting behind the cross. They're kind of in, engraved into the coin. They go deep in the coin. Whereas non-incused version, the lines are all level with each other. Go back here, incused version. You can, you can see that the lines are not level. You know, they've been pierced. The, 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 the actual art, the, the outlining, it's been pierced into the coin. Here the lines are all level. So that's how you spot the difference. And, and yeah, the incused version on the left, there's only 200,000 of those manufactured. They're worth looking out for. Um, if you do stumble across one, you might want to take notice because they do go for up to $100 on eBay. Yep, lines are, clearly you can see the outlines of the lines. Where these lines on the cross are all level. By the way, the non-incused 50 cent coin has 16.6 .6 million pieces minted. So the one of the one on the left with only 200,000 coins in comparison is somewhat quite rare.